Well, the countdown to Christmas continues, and we love this time of year. Yeah, just over a week away now, 10 News reporter Leslie Ackerson is live at Dollywood getting us into the Christmas spirit. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Russell. Good morning, Abby. We talked about this morning, 5 million lights covered the park, and I'm moving around all morning long to see the different spaces that they're decorating. Right now, we are on Show Street inside the park, and I have Wes Ramey here to talk about all that Smoky Mountain Christmas offers this holiday season. Wes, first of all, let's talk about the lights. It probably took a lot of work to put <laughs> these up, right? Yeah, so we start in June. So 5 million lights, it's going to take a little bit of time. So all the lights you see on the building, they start putting those up in June uh, when the park is closed and when guests aren't here because we don't want to interrupt up that experience but all the trees all of the the giant Christmas ornaments that you see all of that moves into the park at the end of our harvest festival so our crews have about six days to transform the park from harvest which is an award-winning festival to this award-winning festival so a lot of work goes into that and but our crews always talk about when they see folks come into the park and see it for the first time or for the first time this year and they see the look on their face that's what they do it for and just the pride of what they do and how much people love it is, is what they enjoy and they really do an amazing job. All that hard work pays off because that's probably my face right now. Let's talk about the shows that people yeah. can see. You have a couple Christmas themed shows and then there's the chapel, of course, as well. Yeah, so we have seven great shows. Uh, Christmas in the Smokies is the headliner. That's been part of this festival since it began in 1990. So that has become a tradition for folks to come see Christmas in the Smokies. But we have It's a Wonderful Life, Oh Holy Night. We've got Twas the Night Before Christmas. Just great Christmas entertainment. And then, as you mentioned, the chapel uh, is lit up and just beautiful this time of year. But every Sunday at 530 our chaplain does a, a non-denominational service that folks are, are welcome to come attend. Excellent Wes thank you so much and you can continue to enjoy this for the next three weeks everything is going to end January 4th that's of course when the park does close for the season but go ahead and get your season pass for 2020 if you buy that season pass before January 4th you can come enjoy Smoky Mountain Christmas. I'll send it back to you all in the studio. Awesome Aww. stuff Leslie thanks.